30. T minus 20. Stage one locks, pressing red light. T minus 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. And that's lift off the Falcon 9. Falcon 9 is in power. As we swap camera angles, while cloud cover may make some of them not visible, the rumble is still audible as Falcon and Dragon ascend through the atmosphere. And we're about to reach supersonic speeds. You'll hear the call out on the net. has gone supersonic, which means that it's traveling faster than the speed of sound, greater than Mach 1, which at that altitude is about 750 miles per hour. We have also passed max Q, which is the maximum dynamic pressure that we will experience. From here on out, it's less and less loads on the vehicle as we continue to ascend. Now we're going to come up on four events in rapid succession. We'll let those happen, and then I'll briefly discuss what they were. But those are Miko, stage separation, second engine start, and then the boost yeah, back yeah, yeah. As you just heard, we had that successful transition from the responsibilities of the first stage to the second stage. Main engine cutoff, stage separation, second stage engine start, and then the boost back burn to bring that first stage back to landing zone one. 